Amber Heard, 36, has been forced to sell her California home in order to pay damages to Johnny Depp, 59, according to reports. The Aquaman star was ordered to pay her ex-husband a total of $8. 3 million after losing the defamation trial brought against the actress by her ex-husband. After a lengthy trial, Amber was ordered to pay $10 million in compensatory damages and $350,000 in punitive damages to Johnny after his libel suit over an op-ed piece she wrote about domestic abuse in the Washington Post. She was awarded $2 million from Johnny from her counter-lawsuit, which leaves her with just over $8 million to pay. However, the actress has publicly stated that cannot afford to pay the damages and has submitted an appeal. It has since been claimed Amber may now have to raise some of the funds she needs by selling her desert California home. According to TMZ, the star has decided to raise some cash by selling her house in Yucca Valley, which is located in the California desert. Amber allegedly bought the house for just over $570,000 in 2019 through an anonymous trust tied to the actress. The outlet said the house was sold for $1,050,000, with a closing date of July 18, according to Zillow Property Records. This would leave Amber the profit of about $480,000, which is still a far cry from the millions she is expected to pay her ex-husband. Express.co.uk have contacted Amber Heard's representatives for comment. After a high-profile defamation trial that lasted six weeks, a verdict for Depp v. Heard was reached on June 1. The jury found in Johnny's favor, with the actor winning all three of his claims against his ex-wife. Meanwhile, Amber won just one of her countersuits and was awarded $2 million in compensatory damages. The defamation trial, which was held in Fairfax, Virginia, followed Amber's 2018 op-ed in The Washington Post, where she discussed experiencing domestic abuse. Amber has since filed a motion to appeal the trial verdict, but it has now been revealed Johnny has followed suit with his own $2 million appeal. Amber's legal team submitted a notice last week, claiming that errors made during the trial prevented a just and fair verdict being returned. A spokesperson for the Aquaman actress said they believe the court made errors that prevented a just and fair verdict consistent with the First Amendment. We are therefore appealing the verdict, they added. While we realize today's filing will ignite the Twitter bonfires, there are steps we need to take to ensure both fairness and justice. Johnny's attorneys followed suit and filed their own paperwork on the counterclaim less than 24 hours later. The documents state, Plaintiff and Counterclaim Defendant John C. Depp, 2, by counsel, hereby appeals to the Court of Appeals of Virginia from all adverse rulings and from the final judgment order of this circuit court entered on June 24, 2022. The actor's representative added, the jury listened to the extensive evidence presented during the six-week trial and came to a clear and unanimous verdict that the defendant herself defamed Mr. Depp in multiple instances. We remain confident in our case and that this verdict will stand, 